Students in Bayonne, New Jersey, have come up with a creative way to tackle the growing problem of bullying. The students tell CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis they hope it makes a difference. All over Jersey and, and America, kids are killing themselves. And that's a really, really big problem. And um, it's hurting families, hurting, it's hurting everyone. This Bayonne High School senior is talking about bullying. He's among students we sat down with who say much of it starts on social media. When you post something, kids are always have negative feedback. Fights, bullying, taunting, and I think it's just an, a big widespread problem. To address the problem, the superintendent and principal turned to the students for solutions. Gathering a group of about 75 student leaders in a series of meetings to brainstorm ideas. We're working with our students to ask them, what can we do for you? What works? What do you think will work? And the students came up with an unconventional approach to anti-bullying, which school leadership is backing. If you can continue to respect everyone in this building, good things are going to happen. It's that simple. Less fighting and bullying at school will result in rewards. Like a half day on a Friday or a delayed opening on a Monday or random dress down day here or fun pep rally here. Just a bunch of different ways to stop bullying. The students say they feel it's a more effective approach than traditional methods like suspension. There's some kids who just don't care if they get suspended. I feel like with this new rule, like you can come together as a big group from freshmen to seniors and everyone can work together. I think everything works better as a team. This is the first time we're doing it. We're not sure if it's going to actually prevent um, like stopping fights, but it's definitely making our community a lot stronger and a lot more positive. The students will get their first incentive Friday, a half day of school with hopefully more to come to help curb bullying here. In Bayonne, New Jersey, Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. Bullying can lead to health, mental health problems for teens already in crisis. In a series of special reports, CBS2 has explored the challenges that children face and how they are finding ways to cope. To hear more about these issues and the solutions, join us for our half-hour special Breaking the Stigma, Children and Mental Health, tomorrow at 5.30. And by the way, those kids, so sharp. Mm -hmm. Gives you so much hope, yeah, right? Yeah, definitely. Great to see.